You Can't Buy a Dinosaur with a Dime by Harriet Ziefert. Clink, clink, clinkity clink. Money in the bank makes your brain thinkity think. I have ten quarters, seven dimes, and six nickels. Pete has three dollars and fifty cents. Pete has nickels, quarters, dimes. He'd like to buy a toy. If he can pay for what he wants, he'll be a happy boy. Mom says, Pete, the money's yours to spend at Harry's store. If you choose to spend it all, then you'll have to save some more. Pete says, I counted my money. I have $3.50. Pete finds a scary dinosaur as green as sour pickles. He wonders how much it will cost in quarters, dimes, and nickels. The lady says, that will be $3 plus 20 cents tax. He had three fifty minus three twenty. Pete has three dollars and fifty cents. His new dinosaur costs three dollars plus twenty cents tax. How much will he have left over? Thirty cents. Pete's bank is almost empty now. He puts it on a shelf. He has a brand new dinosaur and 30 cents of total wealth. Pete holds Tyrannosaurus Rex. He names him Ugly Jack. Then he reads a comic book, If the Dinosaurs Came Back. The name of his book. At dinner, Pete is looking sad. He wishes for more money. Though he likes his dinosaur, an empty bank feels funny. You'll get two dollars, says his dad, if you clean the yard. Then you can start to save again. The work is not too hard. Pete carries out old papers and sweeps the dirty floor. He sorts through the recycling and puts it by the door. Here are eight new quarters, his dad says with a smile. Pete is glad to get them. He'll save them for a while. Here's two dollars all in quarters, says his dad. <clears throat> Pete has 30 cents left over. <clears throat> then he makes two dollars all in quarters for cleaning the yard. How much money does he have? Two dollars and thirty cents. When Pete get hit, gets his allowance, he puts it in his bank. I have lots of change. Here's your allowance for the week. Five dimes, five nickels, clickety clinkety clank. Lucky Pete, he finds a dime. On his way to school. He sells six baseball cards to Kate. Who thinks that cards are cool? I'll give you five cents for each. He has three dollars and five cents. He sells six baseball cards to Kate. She gives him five cents for each card. Which is thirty cents. How much does he have all together? Three dollars and thirty-five cents. Pete puts the money in his bank. Six nickels and a dime. Forty cents goes through the slot, one coin at a time. Pete hears the car keys jingling. Dad's walking out the door. I'd like to come along, Pete says, to shop at Harry's store. Can you count out coins equal to the amount of money Pete has? The store is full of pretty things all lined up row by row. But Pete is after dinosaurs and knows just where to go. A small dino costs $2. A triceratops is 3 Pete says, the little dinosaur is better for me. Pete makes a tough decision. Dad's waiting at the door. He chooses Stegosaurus and won't spend any more. That will be two dollars plus fifteen cents tax. Three dollars and forty-five cents minus two dollars and fifteen cents equals 
one dollar and thirty cents. Pete carries his own package. Dan says, let's get a snack. And you can bank your money as soon as we get back. <laughs> clink, clink, clinkity clink. Money in the bank makes your brain thinkity think. Pete has $1.